Jamie, it's just devastating. According to this report from the NTSB, witnesses said the plane didn't sound right before it took off. The report does not say what caused the crash, but states that witnesses said the engine sounded strange and that they heard popping sounds and that the plane climbed no higher than 200 feet above the runway as it was taking off. The report also says no distress calls were made from inside the aircraft. All of this happened two weeks ago when the plane crashed into a garage attached to an apartment building in Keene, less than a mile away from Dylan Hopkins Airport. No one inside the apartment was hurt, but the plane's pilot and a passenger were were both killed. They've since been identified as 41 year old Lawrence Marchioni from Baldwinville, Massachusetts, and 60 year old Marvin David Desendorf from Townsend, Vermont. And we reached out to Monadnock Aviation, the company that owns the plane, and they said they have no comment. In the studio, Hannah Cotter, WMUR News 9.